this is like the awkward post-match this interview. Or, or, or Reservoir Dogs. You know, Mr. Pete, when he's walking out, and all going slow. It's like... <laughs> and you're just walking along. Anyway. So, we, <laughs> so uh, we just want to talk about what's coming up this year, Resilience Project. Uh, we have a pretty big year ahead of us. Um, the first thing that I'm really excited about, I think I missed most uh, during 2020, was doing the big public talks around the country. Um, so we've got them coming up. We'll announce the dates very soon. Uh, all the normal venues, plus we're going to go to uh, Hobart, Launceston, Gold Coast, Canberra, Perth, Newcastle. Uh, regional places also include Ballarat, Bendigo, Warrnambool, uh, and a couple of others that we're going to. Hang on. In really small riding. Really small Sheridan. Riding. Oh, Shepparton. Shepparton. Shepparton and Shep. Geelong as well. Shep is awesome. Um, so can't wait to get there. So tickets will be coming out very soon for that. Um, we're lucky to be working with 400 schools this year in the partnership program. Excited to um, present to the kids, hopefully face to face, um, to the staff and to um, obviously the parents as well. We're really privileged to be able to doing that. Just for all teachers out there knowing that we've got a standalone teacher wellbeing um, session that we're providing now, and we're really looking forward to doing that, which is huge from our point of view. The, the three, teachers are massive. The, uh, uh, the three-year evaluation from Melbourne University uh, has just completed, and the. Uh, the findings that will be coming out this year, which we're really, really excited about. We've learnt a lot about our program, thanks to Melbourne University's, Melbourne University's evaluation. Going away to Orange, up in New South Wales. We're going uh, to Townsville, to Mackay, and we're also going to Warrnambool. So the regional areas, we're going to be going there for about a week, where we get to work with um, some phenomenal people. That's going to be massive. Right, oh, and I'm supposed to go again. I apologise, I made a mistake. Early years program. Kindergarten, early childhood. We've got to 80 schools. It's fantastic. Um, we've been really fortunate the schools have taken that on board in terms of the early years and the kindergartens and just giving, I suppose, the early childhood educators and the kids an awareness that these are things they can do even if they're three years of age. There's things that we can help ourselves with. Our podcast comes out soon as well. Uh, the Imperfects uh, will be having quite a few more episodes this season, which we're really excited about. Uh, the other one's Coles Partnership, uh, who are uh, education partners. Uh, we did a great program with them last year, and that's continuing with the 120,000 of their staff doing the Resilience Project every single day. We've run out of room in the laneway, so we have to stop. <laughs> uh, plenty more happening, but uh, that's all we've got time for and space for uh, in this chat. So we'll look forward to seeing you when, when we see you. <laughs>